Levi Trumbull reporting in Washington County, Maryland at the Washington County State's Attorney's Office to report on potential prosecutorial misconduct. You cannot video people against, it's a felony. To video Sir, people against their will yes. in a public lobby? Yes. No, it's not. I want to help you, but I, I'm on camera here. here. And they're interfering. So swing back, come, swing back this when is they're great. not here and we'll help the public. Turn that off. Or I'm, I'm going to keep recording you. We're in a public lobby. You can't walk into a store. Recording I'm you. advising you to stop recording And me. I'm telling you, no. Okay. I believe that that's a felony. He doesn't know the difference between private, uh, private but open to the public, and public. Correct. There's, there's, it's different. Yeah. Oh, isn't, he, isn't he calling the police? What's he doing? It's one thing for the public not to know it, but when you work in a judicial setting and you don't know it, it's pretty bad. The Washington County State's Attorney's Office. If you know your party's extension, you may dial it at any time and you will be connected to their voicemail. Please wait while your call is being transferred. Please leave a message after the tone. Hey, good afternoon. This voice message is for Mr. Christopher McCormick at the Washington County State Attorney's Office. My name is Levi Trumbull. I am currently working on a story involving some dialogue that was exchanged between myself and you on October 10th, 2023, where there was a suggestion of criminal conduct by the act of photography in a public environment, that being a news report which was being filmed in the lobby of the Washington County State's Attorney's Office. So I'm calling you today to learn a little bit more about that incident in particular. I was wondering if perhaps we could set up a time and I could come in there into the Washington County State's Attorney's Office and perhaps we could go through the 2023 Maryland Code of Criminal Law to locate that particular statute that you were referring to. I would like to know how that crime is defined under Maryland law. I would also like to know the elements of a crime like this one. I would also be interested to know what the maximum punishment is for that particular crime. I know that there was some suggestion that it might be categorized as a felony. I would like to confirm that is the case and it is not a misdemeanor. I am also just generally curious as to some of the defenses that can be raised by a defendant when they are facing that kind of a criminal charge. Is there a situation where someone could claim immunity from a charge like that? Also, I would be curious if utilizing flash photography could be considered an aggravated factor at sentencing and if upon conviction of a charge like that, somebody could be subject to losing all of their cameras. Another thing that uh, just generally has me curious is how is it that the state attorney's office can mount surveillance cameras from their ceilings, and that's lawful photography, but when somebody else's camera is in the building, that is considered illegal. Finally, from what I understand, there has been some dialogue online about the pink shirt that was worn by you on October 10th. I wouldn't know if you had any comment on that, um, but actually I own one that's very similar, to be honest with you. So personally, I really can't speak against it. But if you have any other thought on that, just let me know. As always, all sides are welcome to have their side of the story told on Levi Trumbull reporting, and that will be the case in this particular instance as well. Thank you very much. Hope to speak with you soon.